Hi guys, it's Kath, and today I'm going to show you how to make this miniature bookshelf. It has an industrial look, so this is perfect for all modern dollhouses. This is such an easy project and only requires popsicle sticks and matchsticks. Let's get started. The first thing I do is grab a handful of jumbo popsicle sticks. Draw two lines to create a three and a half inch section. This will be the length of our shelves. Cut that out. Because popsicle sticks are quite thin, I cut two of these for each shelf. I just stack the two pieces together using some wood glue. And use some binder clips to clamp the pieces together as the glue dries. This will help prevent any warping. Here's one shelf done. Make five of these in total. Do the exact same process for one inch sections. We also need five of these. Now grab a handful of matchsticks. Mine are craft matchsticks so they don't have the match head. I measure and cut out two one inch pieces. And also cut out two half inch pieces. These four sections will form a rectangle. I glue them together using some wood glue. Make five of these rectangles. So in summary, five three and a half inch pieces, five one inch pieces, and five of these rectangles. Small tip here, the matchstick rectangle should be exactly the same size as the one inch pieces you cut from the popsicle stick. Okay, let's stain and paint the wood. To create the stain, I mix some dark brown acrylic paint with some water. Paint that onto all the popsicle stick pieces. Add on more layers if you like a darker look. The most important thing is that the color looks even. For the matchstick rectangles, I'm just using some black acrylic paint. I leave the outer edges of the shorter sides unpainted because that is where we will glue it to the shelves. Once all the paint is dry, we can get to the best part, which is assembling it. I take one long shelf and add a line of glue to one end. Then position one of the shorter pieces vertically on top of it. Add another line of glue half an inch away from the other end. Position one of the matchstick rectangles on top of there. Add some glue to the tops of these short pieces and put on another shelf. I flip mine over so I can add additional shelves onto the bottom instead of the top. It really doesn't matter. Almost done! Here are the last two pieces. Glue those on too. As a final touch, I just go back in with some stain to touch up any areas that look a little light. And done! It's a super easy project that takes very little time and even less materials. I hope you guys like this video. Give it a thumbs up if you did and make sure to subscribe for more. I have two new videos every single week. I'll see you next time. Bye!